Okay, you're either going to love this video or you're going to completely hate that. We're about to refactor some code. This code here is written in JavaScript. Yes, there are still people in 2024 writing code like that. So let's have a little bit of code review here. And I would like you to know that there are some amazing tips I'm going to share with you. So stay with me. It's just five minutes, just five minutes. By the way, my name is Davey and I write code. I'm working on a gem platform where we help engineers actually become better at doing the job. And this code comes from there. So as you can see here, the first line, is the first code uh, here, it's a function that basically says should be a function. So it's a wrapper around the fact that you can check that something is a function. And it will call type of function, it's equal function. So which means that that thing here, you're checking against the fact that that thing is a function and you use that in the test to basically uh, uh, avoid repetition, right? That's basically what you do when you, you program here. So the first thing I want you to realize that written this way, it's not needed if you use something like TypeScript. You could simply go here and say, hey, um, I'm just gonna have this as a func and then put a function here, yeah. So that will be the first thing. By writing, just by writing this, you don't need this thing anymore. Uh, literally, you just don't need that. So let me continue quickly here. Let's take the should resemble a maybe. So that's a function that basically say, you're going to receive something that is an object. It looks like an object because that's the name they gave that thing. And then they're going to check that that object has three function, a map, a fold, and a chain, and it's called that should be a function, right? So here is the way you will improve that using TypeScript. So you're going to create an interface and you're gonna call that interface maybe. And in that interface, you're just gonna give it three function right there. Thank you, Copilot. And if we go a little bit higher, we see indeed that now that maybe could then be used over there or anywhere we need something that looks like a maybe, which means that this is not needed anymore, right? You, you with me there? Right, so uh, uh, the, the function at the top should be a function was actually used right there three times, right? So let's continue over there. Now, we also have a function that says should resemble either. Like once again, I used to write that code like 10 years ago when you were writing with JavaScript and not really TypeScript, you used to write like, oh, I want to check if that thing is an object is a, because you, had, you didn't have the other option. And people are still doing that today. So you're going to achieve the same thing here by going with an interface and you're gonna call that either. And then you basically pass it the, these two uh, functions right there. So if we go a little bit further here, we see indeed that we can then do something like this. Right, now, once that is done, it means that we don't need that. We don't need this thing, which by default means you don't need this, you don't need this one, and let me go all the way up, you don't need this. So, all the boiler code that we had there comes down to, uh, to this, these two interfaces. That should be the end. But not yet. I can hear all the TypeScript developer in the room being like, David, stop with functions. Yeah, okay, you'll be right. Uh, but before I show you how you can improve uh, this part here, where you actually don't use function, you use something way more precise, way more um, uh, defined for what map fold and chain could be, I would like to show you something really cool. There is a bit of repetition here, right? Like previously we had function wrapping behavior so we can reuse this function. We actually have the same here. We have a maybe that has a, a map, a fold and a chain and either that also has a map and a fold. So what you could then do here is to say, well, we're going to remove map and fold from here. By the way, before I even go there, I'm gonna show you something. Let me create a maybe object and we're just gonna say that that thing is a maybe. And hopefully, once we do that, uh, Copilot will help us by providing um, uh, some implementation there, okay? So let me just accept that. There you go. We have uh, uh, some implementation here of uh, three functions that are doing uh, 
something a little bit uh, crazy here, but that's okay. That's completely okay. But you see, it's green. It's not complaining. What I mean by that, if I remove this, maybe it will turn red because now TypeScript knows that hey, that thing is a, a, a needs to have a map, right? So let's go back all, all the way up here. So what I'm doing is basically saying map and fold are already available in either. So what I could simply do is to say, comment out this and then go here and say, hey, this one here will extend either. And you see, that should still work. If we go all the way down here, it should still work. Like maybe doesn't have, uh, we didn't define map and fold right there. So if I go here and uh, I do this, it will still complain because it says like, hey, um, map should be there. So that is one thing. Hopefully you see the power of the extend right there, the extend keyword. There are other ways to do that in TypeScript, but let's just stick with that for now. And now uh, the last thing is what do you do with the function? Function is not as different as using any, right? In, a, in, in reality, in TypeScript, it, it is not. But here, what I want to do is to make sure that you could use something uh, different than function. So what you could do is actually have an interface for map, an interface for fold, an interface for chain, like a dedicated interface for each of them. And then you could make sure that these interfaces are used there instead of the keyword function. That will probably take a little bit longer for this video, but I want you to know that that's the direction you should be going to. And before I end, I want to ask you something. You, there is a button right there. What people call that the subscribe button. If you click that button, you're going to have awesome video like this one every single day, day or, or weeks. Doesn't matter. Click that button. I, no, I, I want, I'm going to put myself right here so that I look at you and say, click it. Okay. Cheers. Bye.